Hey everybody, Billy from Billy's Bike Adventures. Thanks for tuning in. Now, uh, Stefan and I are doing proper camp food stuff tonight. Uh, we're at Lourdes in South, South France, um, very close to the Tet and the Pyrenees uh, Mountains. And we're doing proper camping tonight <clears throat> and uh, therefore we are cooking our own meals. Now, I have got Expedition Foods, chili con carne. Stefan's got the same chili con carne, but who is it made by me? Uh, fair, Wayfarer. Wayfarer. Now, my food is dry and I have to boil water and add water into the pack. Stefan's food is wet and he has to boil in the bag. Uh, my food is done already. Stefan's uh, just going on for a little bit longer. Um, so stay tuned and we'll tell you what we think of them. If this is your first time here at Billy's Bike Adventures, don't forget to click the subscribe button and hit the bell notifications and click all to make sure that you don't miss out on anything. So uh, I've added the, the water to mine now and uh, just given it a few minutes to uh, soak up the water and it uh, doesn't actually look too bad. And first taste. First taste is actually, right, it's not too bad. It's not, it's not um, homemade uh, chili con carne by any stretch of the imagination, but it's actually uh, not inedible, is it? Is it either. It's quite delicious, if I'm honest. Um, easily uh, edible, and it tastes not too bad. So uh, thumbs up for Expedition Foods. We'll wait to see what Stefan thinks of this in a minute. Right, Stefan, you've had a first mouthful. Give us a look at what it looks like. Actually looks uh, quite appetising. Actually, um, tell us what it tastes like. That's not bad. That's not. That's really good. It's not homemade. I know, but it, it tastes really good. Yeah, I'd be quite happy to eat that. Yeah. Yeah. Happy with that? Chili con carne. Yeah. First rate. Yeah. Well done, Wayfair. So there we go. Expedition Foods, and also Wayfair as well. Um, tried and tested chili con carne. Uh, boil in the bag and also add water for the for the expedition. Uh, good taste test. Uh, we'll tell you tomorrow morning if it goes through us like a dose of, dose of salts. Right, we've just done a taste test of each other's. Um, now, uh, let me go first with uh, what I think of Stefan's compared to mine. So the texture of mine um, is a lot more gritty and not, I, sorry, it's not gritty, but it feels like I've got, I've got different, different ingredients in my mouth. When I tasted Stefan's, although um, uh, as delicious as the one I, I'm eating, it did actually feel like I was putting porridge in my mouth from a texture perspective, but then the taste was actually not as bad, was, was as good as the one that I've got. Stefan, what about you? I prefer this, the Wayfarer. It's just soft, that's a bit more chewy, a bit drier, I think. Um, this, yeah, this is very moist, and um, yeah, it would fill me up nicely. So uh, there you have it, Stefan prefers his, I prefer mine. Interestingly, I wonder what our thoughts would have been if we had tried, each, if we had had each other's packs and that was our first taste test of uh, camping food at that time. So um, thumbs up for both. Yep, good. Um, and so uh, take your pick. Do let me know in the comments below um, if you've had Expedition Foods before or Wayfair Foods, which one you prefer. If you haven't tried either one, give it a go and let me know in the comments below what your thoughts were. But uh, from a taste-wise perspective, thumbs up for both of them. Yeah, both of them. I just wanted to highlight the kilo calories that you get from these particular packs. So both of these packs are chili con carne. For the Expedition Foods, you get 809 kilo calories for this particular meal. Uh, compare that to Wayfarer, and you're only getting 444 for the same meal. So uh, energy uh, levels are better for the Expedition Foods versus the Wayfarer. Price value, I'm not going to go into price because uh, just that just depends on what you can afford. Uh, but for energy levels, which is really important when you're doing the, these kind of uh, tech trips, um, Expedition Foods uh, is the winner for me. Thanks for watching Billy's Bike Adventures today. Leave any comments down below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. But for now, that's all and I will see you again very soon.